Good evening, everybody. My name is Christina Roldan. I am majoring in international relations and minoring in German here at Penn. After graduating from Christian High School in South Florida, I decided I wanted to do something different before starting college. So I did an exchange year in Germany before coming to Penn. The experience of living abroad away from my family, a family that I am extremely close to, led me to cry out to God in ways I hadn't done so before. Whenever things got tough, homesickness, either from emotional or physical separation from home, I knew that I could only rely on God for help. My father and mother were not physically with me in Germany, but surely God was there. And he indeed came through when I was able to find a second host family who happened to be believers as well. And I became extremely close to them. After I returned from my year abroad, I moved almost immediately to Philadelphia to start undergrad. This was not easy. I remember taking an intro environmental studies class to quote unquote ease back into academics. Mm -mm. <laughs> I actually recall feeling a bit betrayed since my idea of what I thought college should be like, a prize after all those advanced classes in high school, was nowhere close to what I was experiencing. Things got tough, and I found myself working harder in class than ever, but not getting the expected grade in return. However, it was during those moments that I remembered what God had done for me during my gap year. The same almighty God who had been with me through the loneliness and unacceptance during the seasons of my exchange year was surely with me again. So I decided to hang on tight and rely only on God not on my grades. I started praying more intentionally. Instead, I started thanking God for his blessings in my life and asked for renewed wisdom in all areas of my life, not just academic. He answered my prayer, I believe, as I've witnessed the power of Christian community, which I found here at GCC, and in the family group leaders who would text me every single week to make sure I was coming out. <laughs> I started making more time for community instead of passively allotting for time, just allowing it to happen. It has been a blessing to make new friends bond over food, both spiritual and physical, in our family groups, Sunday sermons, and the January college retreats. I know that God's grace is renewed every morning, and it is amazing indeed, as I have witnessed over my last four years here at Penn and at GCC.